Good morning, Cancer. Hello, welcome to my channel. My name's Catherine from Soul Siren Tarot. Uh, here to do our general reading um, for the week of um, 7th, sorry, 8th to the 14th of May. All right, so it's a general reading, so it's not going to resonate with everybody, but for those who need to hear the messages, hopefully you pick those up and they help. Um, or if it's not for you, just kick it to the curb, or if it, someone you know might benefit from it, please do share it. All right, uh, I've pre-blessed the deck. If you want a private reading with me, you know you know how to do that. The details are in my description box below. Take you to my website. All right, um, beautiful energies. All right, guys. So without further ado, let's see what's going on. And if it does resonate with you and you're enjoying these readings, please can I ask that you like and subscribe and share because it, it helps me keep this channel growing uh, and alive. Yeah, because. Uh, we're getting lots of good feedback that so many people are getting so much out of it and I'm really appreciating that feedback too. Okay, sorry Spirit, I'm not getting the, the light. Cancer, please, week ahead. Spirit, please. Yeah. Cancer, week ahead. Cancer, week ahead. Yeah, caught it. Oh. Soulmate. Soulmate incoming. Okay. Absolutely beautiful. But, Cancer, <laughs> I've got the Knight of Swords here, right, you know my Knight of Swords is, it's like my controlling card, yeah, it's someone who, who, who's at you all the time, mentally at you all the time, pushing you, controlling you, you know, not giving you time to think in your own space, dark energy, I don't know if someone's with a soulmate at the moment is going through a difficult time or, if, or this is moving away from a soulmate that moved into that energy. I'm going to get clarity. Yeah, look. This is an offer. I need to see these rest of these cards. Not clear what we're dealing with. Right. Right. Yeah, okay. Whoever I'm connecting with in Cancer right now, you've had to go through a period of rebalancing, right? Sorry, I'm putting these cards on to look, I'm not sharing sure out, I didn't mean that. Page of Coins, see, I was just feeling the collective energies. Page of Coins here is an offer, it's an opportunity, right? Someone coming forward with an offer, right? And whatever this offer is, and I feel like this isn't a love offer because it's Page of Coins, this is material, right? Cancer, right? So I feel like you've been through a period of great difficulty in your life where you've either released a soulmate or you're having to push a soulmate back at the moment and that's been very, very painful. What that situation has done is moved you on to create a bright new future for yourself because what I've got here is the Page of Coins, right? Which is that, that offer which takes you absolutely to your Ten of Coins, right which rebalances your energies the scales after the pain you suffered from that soulmate yeah can you see it mm. yeah rebalancing those scales just it's kind of like me justice but it's you physically doing it so we've got on the deck now soulmate knight of swords brutal you know tough energy control and manipulative then an offer comes in ten of coins and your cups start you know your scales start to be rebalanced after a period of feeling i'm going to say cancer yeah a period of feeling um withdrawn and not um just not getting enough in your life you're thirsty that's why i want to say starved yeah, starved, like where the work wasn't going well, you know, your coins weren't coming in as well as you'd hoped, love wasn't coming in, you weren't getting what you needed in that area, just just feeling like, well, what next? That's what I'm sensing. But what you did is you went with him, you know, you know what this is, going inside, doing your introspection, doing your work, learning your lessons, understanding what went, what went on, what went wrong in this situation, it is. Now, yeah, I do, I feel it. But I feel you're right to that now because we're moving towards offers and abundance. And it's a bit similar to the daily reading we had today. I feel like this is this, this soulmate's gone into hermit mode. I do. Look, I told you. That's where you was. That's where they are now. Consistent. Because this is, this is coming under this Knight of Swords energy. Okay. That's what it's doing. This person wants to open up. This person was very selfish in the past. 
now they want to open up but I feel like they may have left it too late to talk to you Empress because you've gone into that energy that space because look you wouldn't bring all this abundance in if you hadn't you may have left it too late you're powering forward they've got a lot of catching up to do yeah what does cancer need to know please spirit no clear that absolutely yeah yeah it is you brought the tower down yeah you did you brought the tower down before this person could completely break you right this person did not think you would go anywhere and you did they didn't think like phoenix rising from the flames right that's that's the vision i'm getting they didn't think you were capable of it yeah, they just didn't think that you were capable of it. You were like a safe bet, really. I can treat this person how I want because guess what? They won't go anywhere. Yeah? They won't go anywhere. Yeah, you will. Cancers were so tough. Yeah? We're such tough, right? We, we have such a hard shell. I say we because I'm a cancer. And don't get me wrong, I take myself out to these readings before I go in for our day, our week, as our days. But um, as, a, 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 as an energy, uh, a sign, style sign, we have a tough exterior, right? And a hard shell. And it takes a lot for people to get past that shell. Yeah? To get into our inner softness. Yeah? And so when they do, we're vulnerable. Right. And if we've let the wrong one in, yeah, which I'm sure we've all done and learnt from, when we've let the wrong one in, we're very vulnerable and it's it's and they they start to see that vulnerability in you and they abuse it. They abuse it. But you got you you managed to get your shell back round you, hermit here. Yeah, you did, and you did the work, and you went inside your shell, look, and you looked through. This is coming up all the time at the moment, the Knight of Cups, for me. In terms of people, the energies at the moment, maybe the Taurus New Moon's helping us, but people are starting to see the transparency, water, see through it. Yeah, cleansing, absolute cleansing, because that's coming across from my hermit. Cleansing of the soul, yeah, look, this is, this is that person. Can't stop thinking about you and what they did. And so, so they should. They should be absolutely ashamed of themselves. Yeah, I know what's going on here. See it? Yeah. yeah. Two foot. <laughs> Beautiful. Those two. Two. I'm gone. I've got three, four flipped over. All right, I've got them. Thanks, Bert. They see you. They realise what they've lost. Queen of Pentacles. Steady, beautiful, nurturing, um, just kind. A super empath, Queen of Coins, yeah. Super, <laughs> super look. Empress. Told you, she was coming out, weren't she? This, babies, is what they're thinking about this loss is keeping them up at night. In the same way they used to have you up at night in unbearable pain. Unbearable pain because it was a soulmate, a soulmate loss. But because they didn't think you'd go anywhere, probably didn't have, even have a concept of what a soulmate connection was. They're brutally realising it now. They absolutely are. Look. Battle. Five ones. They know they've got competition. They know they've got competition. But at the moment, I've got King of Swords here. And I feel this person is still trying to stand firm away. Okay. I do. I do. I don't know why they're doing what they're doing. Right? Because they know what they've lost. And they know what they want, yeah. And they're grieving. They're grieving with the Nine of Swords. But they're not moving. Not moving. Not moving. 
I feel like they're trying to get mental clarity. I feel like this is somebody who fights to um, work from the mind rather than the soul. Right, I do. And ultimately that will catch up with them, right? Yeah, yeah, look. Yeah, they're missing you, they know. Yeah, they know. They know what they've lost. And wherever they've gone to, because they will have, wherever they've gone to, they're not finding that connection. It's not satisfying them. Not in a way that it felt when they were with you. It's not. It can't look. That is rare. Cancer. That is rare. This is a huge loss for this person. Yeah. But what I want you to remember is even if you're still hurting coming out of this energy now, Cancer, you will look back on this situation because they weren't a worthy soulmate. And you will be the one. I can see it. Ten of coins here. Yeah. Sent to you. Purring forward. Manifesting a new journey. You will look back on this person in a way that doesn't hurt anymore. That um, they just weren't worthy because you're going to meet someone who's an absolute soulmate match. That's what you're moving towards, right? But this person is never going to get another you. Remember my sayings in my dailies, if you watch them, you can look inside these other people as much as you like to try and find me. And you never find me. Because this person thought, you know, a woman or a man is just a woman or a man. Yeah, that was that was the energy they were thinking. You, that you, were, you were replaceable. Yeah, you're not. Nine of cups. Yeah. Your cup's filling up. Independence for me, like me nine of coins. Yeah. See the abundance. See the joy. See the happiness. It's like holiday, isn't it? It's like a holiday table, isn't it? And I love it because, can you see, it's like there's a big cup here. Yeah, big opportunity for me. Um, then we've got all these supporting cups. This is people around you, happy, joyful. All this beautiful food and abundance. And then can you see the side of the two flutes? Just remind me of the lovers in the, uh, the offer card. Yeah, it's magical. Yeah, I'll take them. Yeah, told you. Oh, wow, judgment, right? This is judgment. But this is the angels. Um, it's like judgment for you, it's the rewards, because, um, yeah, can you see, I said about my nine coins and two nines here, completions, you are moving in a completely, into a different energy vibe, a different rock pool, a different way of being, a different plane altogether, and this person's constantly going to be looking up, knowing what they lost, knowing what they did, living in that energy, yeah, always trying to find you in someone else, you're not baby, you will, honestly, because you're such a big high vibe person, yeah, cancers are so intuitive as well, yeah, that, <coughs> excuse me, because I'm doing all the readings, cup of my tea, okay, you're, you're building your foundation, you're just focused on your craft, but this is becoming master of your craft, so for some of you Cancerians I'm reaching out to you right now, you may, you may be starting an absolute whole new beginning. Because having been through this this journey with this person, what did it what did I say? New beginning. The fool. You can't make it up. Yeah, new chapter. Absolute whole new beginning. Mastering your craft. Because you're fearless now. When you've been through such pain. And you've got through the other side and you've survived. You feel this. So actually, this person helped. They helped you to grow. They helped you to connect to source and do something amazing. That's what I feel. I'm connecting with some of you cancers. Yeah, look. Rebirth. After you ended it with this person, you went through a rebirth. But you've done it because it's here. Absolutely. This. Can you see? Death to an old way of being. Death to an old way of being. Some of you, some, you're either thinking about it, yeah, or, you know, you, you're already on that journey, but, oh, look, new paths, yeah, 
whatever you're thinking of, dreaming of, yeah, spirit's saying do it. You know you're going to survive. Trust in us now. You will find your way down that pathway. Yeah, but choose a path. If you've not started your journey, start it. Commit to it. Go after it, Cancer. Go after it. You can do this. Don't stay stuck like you were before. Let it go. Release it. Release it. Power forward. Yeah. Absolutely, Cancer. Absolutely stunning. Loving this energy. No. Yeah. They are mad regretful. Mad regretful and if you're not seeing them again or they're not communicating it's because they have not got the shame to face you you will always look back forgive them but if you look back you'll wonder why you was even there in the first place they will be looking up trying to find an empress queen of pentacles you're gonna find one I'm going to find you in anyone. All right, beautiful people. Thank you so much. Hope this, this hit reading helped to jig you on. Follow your dreams, beautifuls. You know, you know you can survive anything now. All right then. See you next week. Good luck. Thank you, Cancer.